This is how you can make a random image generator command using your discord.js version 14 bot. So let's go ahead and get started. Before we actually get started with the code here, I would like to say that I have introduced the server shop to my discord server. So in this, I will be selling bot packages such as mod mail, moderation commands, AI bots, game bots, etc. So if you're interested in purchasing a bot package, go ahead and join the server in the description below and head over to the server shop. I will be introducing more packages soon and our AI bot package should be out by the time you're seeing this video. You can also get a god tier on Discord if you're interested in getting access to the source code from all of the videos on my channel. So again, if you're interested in any of this, go ahead and click the link in the description below. And with that, we can go ahead and get started. So we're going to go over to community and we can go ahead and create random image.js. And here we're going to get our slash command builder. We can also get our embed builder. And then we can do equals require and we're going to go ahead and get discord.js. Then we can do const axios equals require and we're going to go ahead and get our axios package following that so we can do module.exports and we're going to go ahead and open this up we can get data which is going to be our new slash command builder and here we're going to go ahead and set a name this is going to be random image and we can go ahead and set a description and we can say get a totally random image then after doing that we can add a comma we're going to do async executes we can go in and get our interaction and we can actually go ahead and open this up so to start we're going to go ahead and defer a reply so we can do await interaction dot defer reply and we can go ahead and set infermal to true then we can do const image equals await axios dot git and we're actually going to be using this website here this is lorem pixum this has a bunch of different images and you can actually go ahead and get one of these links and you can actually go ahead and use axios to get the image every time you run it and there's a bunch of different filters you can use. You can blur, you can use grayscale, all on these images. So if you're interested in learning a little bit more about this and getting all of the other things you could do with this, this link will be available for you in the description below. But for us, we're going to be using a random image link. So this is going to be the link we're going to get. It is going to be the pick some photos and then slash. And then these numbers right here are the dimensions of your photo. So in the website, it's 300 by 300. For me, I'm going to do 1920 by 1080 because that's a full image. And that's going to be question mark random equals one so that's going to be the link we're going to be posting or getting from and then we can do const embed equals new embed builder we're going to go ahead and just set a color this is going to be our blurple color and then we can go ahead and set an image and we're going to go ahead and get our https and we can do fastly.pixum.photos and then we can do slash and we can do image.request.path so we're basically going to get the link and then we're going to get that path so we basically just constructed a url out of the data we got from our image right here so all we have to do now is send this so we can do await interaction to edit reply and we can get our embeds which is going to be our embed and with that, we are actually done with all of this. So we can go ahead and save the file, restart the bot, and test this out. All right, so over in the Discord server here, we can actually go ahead and test this out. I'm going to go ahead and get our random image command. And if we go ahead and send it here, as you can see, it's going to go ahead and think, and then it's going to go ahead and get me a totally random image. And it's just going to be a normal image. There's not going to be any grayscale or filter applied to this. Again, if you'd like to try that, you can go ahead and use this website right here. But we can actually go ahead and run this a couple more times just to show that this is completely random. Here's another image, and we can go ahead and do this again. We're going to get our random image, and there's another random image. We can try this one more time just to show that it's not going to generate the same image. And as you can see, there's another one right here. So this isn't particularly useful, but it is pretty cool. And there's definitely a lot of uses you could apply this to. So yeah, that's how you can make a random image generator command using your discord.js version 14 bot. If you do need any help with this, go ahead and join the server in the description below and use our help channels here. I'll be happy to help you out. And you might as well just join anyways, because this is a pretty good coding community. And with that, I'll see you guys in the next video.